A milestone has been reached in the production of the Typhoon and the government has just revealed the aircraft has intercepted Russian jets off the UK coast 30 times in the last three years. The first Tranche 3 airframe is currently being built at a factory in Lancashire from where Tim Cooper sent this report. The Typhoon has been in the hands of the RAF since 2007, becoming fully combat ready in 2008. And the twin-engine multi-role fighter was put to the test in 2011 as it flew combat missions from Gioia del Colle in southern Italy during the Libya campaign. But although Typhoon's in service, that's not the end of its design and development story. This is BAE Systems Factory at Wharton in Lancashire where they built the Typhoon. And work is well underway on the first of the latest variant, the Tranche 3 Typhoon. And this is the first one, which has its major components in place and has recently had its electrical systems turned on for the first time. Tranche 3 takes the Typhoon forward, refining and developing its systems and integrating the latest capabilities as required by its Air Force customers. Well, externally, you know, from the outset, you most probably won't uh, notice an awful lot, but you know, anybody with something like a, a home computer realises that whilst the frame may look the same, what actually goes on inside is, uh, is completely changed, and Typhoons are no different to that. So we're looking at modifications in the fuel system, we're looking at modifications within uh, uh, the avionics uh, side of things. Alongside upgrades across the board, specific components are being changed. This variant of Typhoon will host the e-scan radar system, which offers increased detection and tracking ranges. Uh, massively important uh, now because it will provide a capability of doing air-to-air um, uh, -air and air-to-surface um, radar um, uh, aspects at, you know, at the same time. Um, and there are also other developments within uh, uh, that e-scan will uh, provide that the current uh, M-scan, although an incredibly uh, capable radar, you know, again will, will, will need to be advanced further and e-scan provides that uh, for us. Externally, the Tranche 3 Typhoon looks like its predecessors, but under the skin it contains the latest technology, which will keep it relevant and capable for years to come. Tim Cooper, Forces News, Water in Lancashire.